Good morning, Facebook family and YouTube subscribers. Well, the past few days, past few weeks, I've been in and out of doctor's office dealing with a variety of health issues. And, you know, every time you walk into a doctor's office, they check your blood pressure and they place you on a scale. Um, earlier this year when I got injured, my weight skyrocketed to 200, almost 270 pounds. So now when I went yesterday, I'm, I'm, I'm down to 248 pounds. So I've lost a lot of weight because I'm back at the gym, back working out right, back eating correctly. But most important thing, I'm back at the gym doing cardio, I'm exercising, um, I'm burning a lot of calories and trying to get. My goal is to get down to 220 pounds. You know why? My weight now at 248 pounds, my blood, blood pressure is sky high. Almost out of under control. If you look at me, you probably would say, well, Walter looks like he's in the best of health. He works out. He's uh, constantly in the gym. Guys, I went to four different doctors. Four. Four different doctors over the past few weeks. And every one of them told me, your weight's too heavy. You, you got too much. You're carrying too much weight. And you got to get this blood pressure down. And so they were switching these blood pressure medicines around, and God, that just took me on a whirl of a blood pressure medicine, gym supplements. They don't really go too well together, as I found out. So the bottom line is I got to get this weight off me. The strange thing is four different doctors who don't know each other, four different doctors who do not know each other, all said the same thing. Um, your blood pressure is sky high. Your weight's too high. You need to lose weight to get your blood pressure down. And it's true. Every time I'm below 220, uh, around 220 or two, under 230, my blood pressure is fine. I don't need blood pressure medicine. But whenever I get close to that 250 mark and higher, my blood pressure gets out of control. And the medicines work. It just has to take a lot of them, various types, and, it cre and they create their own side effects. I don't like blood pressure medicine. Um, the blood pressure medicine has a tendency to um, cause me a great anxiety. And a lot of other problems that come, a lot of people don't probably don't think about that because you know you just think it's a blood pressure pill. But those pills have a lot of side effects and I don't like it. But what the reason I was doing this video is I keep hearing from people saying it's okay to be overweight and healthy. You could be overweight and healthy. So I always ask these doctors why do people assume it's okay to be overweight and healthy? Because you, every doctor I've gone to has ever, always told me, your weight's a little high for your body. You need to lose some weight. And guys, I'm kind of fat. I'm not going to lie. I know it. I know. I need to lose some weight. So when I hear people say this, it's okay to be healthy and overweight. Where are they getting this information from? Who's telling them these lies? That's a lie straight out of hell. That's why African Americans have the highest obesity rates, the highest diabetes, blood pressure, kidney problems, dialysis, because of being overweight. If I continue to stay overweight, if I continue to allow my weight to stay where it is, not get this blood pressure under control, I'm going to end up on dialysis. Because that blood pressure will destroy my kidneys. High blood pressure will destroy my kidneys and I will end up on dialysis. And I'll be over at the DeVita Clinic. Like everybody else I know. Why don't we understand this? How did my weight get so high? Well, I, last summer I got down to 220 pounds because I went running and jogging every day. This summer, of course, I suffered an almost fatal injury. Now I forget them. Okay, did you either? You don't forget the drag queens or Tyler Perry's goons, or whoever it was that came and got me and tried to kill me for whatever reasons. Whatever story you want to believe, that's fine with me. But seriously, I know I cannot continue down this path for my scope. But they, one doctor I went to. They, they wanted to hold me while in their office while they gave me some blood pressure medicine. They were going to call an ambulance because my blood pressure was that high. 
And um, so I decided to just wait. They gave me some medicine. I sat there for an hour or two, and they brought my blood pressure down. And we noticed a difference. And then uh, they allowed me to leave. And they kept monitoring them. So now I've got to buy, I've got to purchase, um, what you need, well, my arms are kind of big. I don't know if you can taste, see this. My arms are kind of big. So I can't, I, I can check it at home, but I need a cuff that will wrap around my arms or some other way I can check my blood pressure. But guys, please, 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 I am begging you all. Do not fall for the lies being told that you can be overweight and healthy. That is a flat out lie. And I don't know who's telling you guys this. If you don't go to a doctor regularly, how will you know your blood pressure is high? Is high? Most people don't know. How do you know your kidneys are functioning properly if you don't go and have them analyzed or your urine analyzed and checked out? Guys, please stop the nonsense. If somebody tells you that it's healthy, that you can be healthy and overweight, don't believe that mess. And if you're going to a doctor who's saying this, you need to really question that doctor because I've never, ever, Y'all, I go to every, I, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a health fanatic. I run my ass to a doctor in a heartbeat. I get a cough and cold. I go straight to my doctor. Now, I've never, ever been in a doctor's office, and they said, it's okay to be overweight and healthy. They look at my big ass and say, how much do you weigh? When I was close to, two, when I was close to 270 pounds, every doctor, they all said the same thing. You weigh too much. That was just a few months ago. Now, I'm going back at 248. They're like, okay, you're bringing the weight down. Yes, I'm bringing the weight down. I'm not no fool sitting here. I know I'm not supposed to be weighing 270 pounds. At one point in my life, many years ago, I, I had ballooned up to 280, 290. Guys, don't lie to yourselves. Don't shortchange your life. You don't have to go to the gym and spend hours like I do. I love working out. But you do need to run, jog, exercise, even if it's at a park, around your home, up and down the streets. You got to exercise and change your diet. You must. You must if you want to live. There's no such thing as being overweight and healthy. Don't lie to yourself and don't allow anyone to lie and tell you that mess either. Unless you, got, unless you have a serious health reason. That keeps you from losing the weight. There is no excuse for not dieting. There is no excuse for not exercising. Turn them damn TVs off. Turn that damn television off. Turn these computers off. Get up and go outside. Go running, walking, jogging an hour or two. It doesn't take much. I do 30 to 45 minutes worth of cardio every day. It brought my weight down. Now I've got to get it down some more. I didn't drop so much stuff over here. I'm drinking my coffee with just a little bit of cream in there. Not even, I don't even put Splenda in there no more. That's how serious I am. I love some sweet coffee, but not anymore. Well, brought this box of donuts. I was going to eat a donut. All right, okay, I ate one last night. But I'm not going to eat one this morning. I'm going to eat my breakfast. And I'm going to get the hell out of here to this damn gym and get on that damn elliptical machine and knock out my 45 minutes and then go head into my regular workout. I just pray and hope you guys are listening. That's all I can say about this. I mean, it's just, I see too many overweight brothers and they're not doing the right things. And we're promoting, to me, it seems as if the black gay community in particular is promoting overweight that it's okay to be overweight. I don't get that. Something's wrong. We should not be promoting unhealthy ish, un, an unhealthy lifestyle of obesity. Anyway, I'm done with that. I hope I have not offended anyone because that's not the purpose of this video. Because um, that's not my goal. So I just want to reach out and give you all some problems that I'm going through concerning my own weight and health issues. May not look like it, but there's a problem here. Anyway, if you like my videos, please click like and give me some feedback. Tell me what you think. I'm cooking breakfast. Now I'm going to have some grits and egg whites. I'm boiling the eggs now. And I have some turkey sausage I'm going to eat. 
And then I'm heading to the gym. And I'm going to do my little protein shake and head out of here. Anyway, you guys have a great day. Today is Wednesday. Today is Wednesday, September 18th. I'm out of here. Love you guys. Have a great day. Bye.